life nowhere. All right, everyone. Welcome back. Yeah. I've been deeply uninspired. If that's a, I don't know, is that a, um, an oxymoron? Yeah. I, I've never been less uh, motivated to create anything. You know, I, uh, yeah, just this world situation is like, it's not, you know, these uncertain times, they're not motivating me to uh, fight the power or to uh, wrestle with the alienation of not being able to go outside. It really is just a fucking drag. Um, I've been trying not to cry the blues for a while because it's just so many people are so much more damaged financially by corona than me. And then also we're talking about, you know, death by police and all this. And it's like, you know, that doesn't affect me either. So it's, it's, it's hard for me, you know, to bitch about not being psyched about making creative work is, uh, is, um, Maybe feels a little bit in bad taste, but you know, I see all these people, they're all like, like, um, so much stuff online. People are like, uh, people are like, you know, it's okay. It's okay to not be productive, you know, give yourself a break. Like it's, you know, you don't have to be productive. Like it's so, you know, it's okay. There's nothing wrong with that. I don't really think it's okay. I mean, it's a fucking, I think it's unacceptable. Uh, whatever. I don't care what other people do, but I, I think it's, I think it's a good thing to force this shit. I think it's valuable to look in the mirror and be like, look, asshole. You have talent. You have skills. Just do, who cares if you don't have cool ideas? Do some shitty ideas. Just, just force doing this shit, man. You know? Um, so this is what, this is actually what this video is. Honestly, since the Fred Moten video, I've just been like, what am I going to really even say? I want to put something out, you know, and just, um, not even really having, um, deep ideas. So yeah, this video is objectively less deep than the other ones. Not everything is going to be equally deep. I had to do something. I'm, this is forced right now. It's forced. Good. I'm forcing this. Um, yeah, it's, it's just, you know, it really makes this Corona shit, it really makes you realize, I mean, not just Corona, but Corona and the protests, everything together. It really makes me realize how much, uh, just the extent to which my, uh, output thus far, <clears throat> just the extent to which it's been dependent on the world outside, you know, that might sound obvious to people, but. I always in the past would have said like, well, you know, of course I engage the world, but you know, the real inspiration comes from inside, you know, the real inspiration comes either from inside or from above, you know, it's either this personal thing or it's the spiritual thing. And then, you know, uh, it's engagement with the outside world is secondary, you know, it doesn't come from the outside world. And I'm realizing how that's kind of bullshit, you know, that like, that there are certain moments that are less inspiring, you know? I think it's almost just the uncertainty of like, it's like, what, what the fuck is out there? What is that going on, you know? Corona, what the fuck is that, man? I, I can't even, I don't believe any media at all about what's happening. It's like there's no adults in the room. I literally, my levels of skepticism, it's like Alex Jones level of like just reading something and being like, that's might be lies um you know uh i mean protest wise you know i mean i believe the reality of the problems that are being addressed but um i mean there's a lot of bullshit sur surrounding that all of the discourse around that shit as well that i'm just like i don't know what to fucking believe so just what's going on i don't even know what's out there and i so it's um yeah so, so in other words, I don't even know what, what world I would be making a statement in. So this forcing, I'm really thinking about retreating into just really spiritually oriented, just underneath, just retracting even further. I don't know, just exiting, just trying to exit, just trying to retreat, just retreat. Um... 
Yeah. I think I think it was Morton Feldman. I'm not sure. Hmm. <clears throat> I think it was Morton Feldman who said, you know, that um, he's like, you know, the the I oh I make an appointment with the muse. I sit down to write music, and uh, if I uh, if the muse doesn't show up, fine. At least I showed up, you know. And writing something shitty or creating something shitty can be a vibe, you know. Like I just started to force it last night, because um, I tell you, man, for a couple of weeks. I was literally waking up drinking coffee and just fucking watching the first two minutes of YouTube videos for like 12 hours and then going to sleep. Like, that's morally dark. You know what I mean? That's not just like, hey, give yourself a break. Fuck a break, dude. I wasn't meant to do that. You know? Um, dude, shame and guilt are cool to an extent. I mean, spirals are not good. Shame spirals, guilt spirals, bad. But shame as a smack in the face, guilt, guilt to stop you from doing something morally bad, it's great. Shame to light a fire under your own ass or to, you know, keep me off drugs, keep you out of trouble. Yeah, I'm ashamed of sitting and watching two minutes of fucking Rogan interview fucking various centrists for fucking 20,000 hours. Um, while my spine curls up into a fucking crustacean. Um, but yeah, I started to force it last night, and yeah, I came up with some shit. It was like, okay, um, it'll be a seed, you know? Haven't gotten into that flow state, you know? The flow state is the real thing, literally being in the zone. That's a neurological thing, flow state. Um, some optimal functioning of your, uh, brain to channel things but yeah even the word inspiration you know it like implies you know inspire it's like breath the breath of the spirit coming from without breathing in i mean sometimes you gotta just force that you know it doesn't just come from god it doesn't just come from some kind of i don't know the shit isn't all magic man um you know uh so in, in any case yeah it's not okay to not get things done for me. You can do whatever you want. Um, and uh, in fact, maybe you watching this, maybe you, you watching this video is part of your wasting time and not getting anything done. In which case, I guess I'm sorry, but maybe you'll turn this off and actually do something. Um, yeah, so I mean, I can confidently tell you that the next thing I put out musically, yeah, it'll be fire because everything I do is fire, but... I'm not that pumped about making this fire, man. It's really an uphill fucking battle. Anyway, thanks for watching. Uh, I'm going to keep forcing it uphill.